Oh yeah, look at my pitcher plant. This motherfucker eats so many flies. Oh, I probably can't see down in there, but... It's sick. Carnivorous plant. Eats the flies that come in my little fucking entry room. Fuck you, flies. <laughs> I'll finish this before we do the review. Hang on. I'll, I'll do the thing. What's up, guys? I'm going to do another one of my shitty reviews today. And today, we're going to do this camera, which I don't know fucking shit about, really. The Caddx Cam. Have you seen these yet? They've been going around for a little bit. Uh, the people posted one, like a pink one. A pink casing on Facebook. And that's why I was like, oh, what's up with this cam? But this one's green. They didn't have the pink. They're fucking like 30 bucks on Amazon and shit. I'll put a link below if you want to check it out. I haven't flown it yet. This will be my first time flying this camera. So you're gonna get definitely an honest fucking first impression review. One thing I don't like, do you see that green and black wire? That's what you use to plug in the little like control board for changing OSD settings. And it's like 30 fucking feet long. I really should have done this while it was, see all that fucking wire mess in there? It's so long. That, right off the bat, get rid of that fucking thing because that's stupid. It looks exactly like the Runcam Mini. Like the casing, the little three holes on the side, everything. This looks just like a Runcam Mini. Except the lens is all fucking big and weird. Which is, uh... What is that? It's a 2.3? 2.3 two, 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 millimeter lens on there? I don't know. The little collar is gray, so that's different than Runcam. But besides that, everything on it looks the fucking... It's just the casing looks exactly identical to a Runcam Mini, and I don't know what's up with that. I don't know if they're like stealing a design or if that's a thing that they can do or whatever. So I'm not trying to be like, check out this sick camera right away. If they are fucking taking shit from Runcam, but whatever. I'm gonna go fly it. It's super gray. It's super shitty outside. It's gonna rain any minute. And super gray really isn't the best for cameras with the light transition and shit. And this thing's on fucking stock settings, so. Check out this DVR. Let's see how it can handle like the grayness, and maybe I'll try it in the sunshine if that ever comes back. Oh my god, I gotta change my video settings. Let's fucking. So first of all, see so us this Caddx US on the bottom. I don't know how to make that go away. I looked in the fucking menu for like some fucking OSD shit, and I did not see a way to make that disappear. So far, that ain't too bad. There's something about the camera. It has, like... It's grainier? Is that what it is? It's like the color is not as rich as a run cam. This is also on uh, stock settings. I didn't fucking do shit. I didn't change anything at all. My run cam my minis and micros, I can just leave on the stock settings and they're completely fine. This one probably needs some color adjustment, but... So far, it's pretty fucking decent. I didn't know what, how I was gonna feel about it. Let's try to go up in the sky. Oh, it's so bright. That color adjustment isn't terrible. I wish I had like some, like a dark building to go in or something to really check it out. What's over here? Let's see if we can come with this thing. I fucking barely made that. Alright. Well, first impression, this is not too shabby. This fucking cam. Like I said, I don't know what's up with the... Um, uh, I don't know what's up with the case design looking exactly like a run cam fucking mini, but... As long as they aren't, like, ripping them off, because they do, like, run cam. And this might be a contender. This actually might be a camera that I use. I just don't support clone shit. So I ain't trying to fucking say, yo, this is good if they're ripping shit off of run cam. I hear it's the same sensor, so I don't fucking know. I'm definitely going to do some more investigating into exactly what's up with this camera, but as far as, like, how it works and shit, it works pretty fucking good. Doesn't help my flying, obviously. All right. I'm going to take it in for a landing. Where am I? There I am. Alright, don't hit myself. I fucking suck at landing. 
so that was legit like my first flight ever with that camera and not anything changed the colors could be a little better but that's not too fucking bad not too bad caddix not too bad guys the uh, i'm used to like shitty flat colors so they don't really need to be all crazy rich when i do fly like my run cam micro and the colors are all super rich and sh oh, shit, I'm the colors are all super rich i'm always blown away i'm like god damn when i see other people's cams with correct settings I'm like oh you can see like colors of things man that's fucking crazy so it's fine like it doesn't bother me that they're they're kind of flat or whatever the shit's um pretty good I, I like this camera actually and it's like 30 bucks like i said i guess we can see light transitions by flying through this i don't know if that'll make too much of a difference but let's do that as a test right now i got i guess when i landed i'm like on this fucking track right so there's like all the stupid dirt from the track and i guess when i landed just now Ah, oh, got fucking. Got dirt in the fucking motor and now it won't spin. Gosh darn it. Oh shit. Never mind, that's not what's wrong. <laughs> it's always some motherfucking thing. I thought there was like dirt. It's my signal wire. My signal wire right here came fucking unsoldered and I don't have my portable soldering iron. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Let me just fucking flip around like a dick in the park. <laughs> Alright, so I guess let's do a summary then. The Caddx Cam is okay. I'm not sure why it looks identical to the Run Cam Mini. I hope they're not like biting something, but if they're not, this is cheaper than a fucking Run Cam. It works pretty fucking well. They need to get rid of the 50 foot long umbilical cord OSD clicker button fucking menu thing, but besides that, I like it. I dig it. I, uh, I'm gonna hit them up and see actually what other kind of designs they got because I'm curious to see what they have besides this, is like the Turbo 1S or some bullshit. If that's the wrong name, I'll put a thing up here, but check it out. I'll put a link below to the Amazon if you want to fucking buy one for like 30 bucks. It ain't that shabby. It ain't too shabby. All right, I'm gonna fucking go get another one of my quads and go fly somewhere else. Maybe I'll make a freestyle video today, but thank you for watching. Cheers.